All right, here we go. Hamstrings. How do we use them? How do we how do we get this whole thing ingrained? Here's what we're gonna do. Rich Airy, say hi. What up? All right. So I'm gonna have him grab onto me for support. He's gonna pull his leg into place. Ankle at the knee. Okay. He's tight here, and he's tight here. If I check either one, it's not gonna hurt him. Okay. I'm going to hold on here. Apply pressure. He is going to resist. We'll come down. He's going to resist. Come down. He's going to resist. We're going to go five to ten of these. Okay? He's going to switch sides. Boom. 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 He's going to relax his ankle, too. See, that ankle needs to relax. Good. Now, I'm going to set him on the treadmill. So, Richard, walk over to the treadmill. So now he's going to run about 100 meters, anywhere from 50 to 100 meters. And you'll notice that he's got his ankles pulling into place each time. He's pretty smooth. He's not real loud. Maintaining that tightness. Check him, check him, check him. Boom. Good, switch it. Ankle into place, exact same place. Relaxes that ankle. If you don't get them to relax the ankle, you're not doing it right. So we've got five, five. Now he's gonna go get on that treadmill again. about 50 meters, pick up the pace if you can, make sure things don't get out of whack. Good, and relax. So, here's your homework. You're going to repeat this five to ten times, okay? You're going to develop those hamstrings. You should feel this in the hamstrings as you're running. You don't have to do anything really greater than 50 meters, okay? If, if you have the ability to go out past 50 and do this exercise, great. Go. Do it a little further. See how fast you can do it because if we can increase the intensity with the skill of it, we're going to, do quick, we're going to develop this whole thing a whole lot quicker than you going out and trying to slug out a 5K or 10K, attempting to put this into, into works, okay? So there's your homework. Get to it.